If you're in the market for a full-size luxury SUV, the Infiniti QX80 is definitely worth a look. Built and assembled in Japan, these things have amazing build quality. They've been a very reliable product for us uh, over the years. Uh, this beautiful 2016 model recently came in on trade. Uh, some of our nicest premium vehicles coming on trade. This example is no exception. Uh, this thing's a beautiful inside and out, very nicely equipped with features. Beautiful uh, semi inline leather seating. Uh, this one is almost fully loaded. They had one higher package called the Limited, which basically kind of gave you like this uh, brown truffle interior and a, a dark chrome accents and a unique little entire package. But aside from that, this pretty much has all the features and technology uh, that you can get in 2016 on the QX80. Uh, really actually not a whole lot different than the brand new QX80s. They've improved them and they've updated them a little bit, but uh, mechanically the QX80s have not changed a whole lot since 2011 when uh, the redesigned QX80 uh, came out. It was called the QX56 back then. Uh, then they changed the name to QX80 in 2014. Uh, so we've updated it and gave it facelifts, but mechanically the nuts and bolts haven't changed much since 2011. And the reason why it hasn't changed is why mess with something that's not broken. You have a very robust, uh, you know, amazing powertrain that's very reliable and durable. Uh, the QX80 is based on uh, the Nissan Patrol uh, global platform. The Nissan Patrol is kind of like Nissan's version of the Land Cruiser. And just like the Land Cruiser, they have luxury versions like the, you know, the luxury version of the Land Cruiser, the, uh, the Lexus LX570. This is a luxury version of the Patrol, or in the United States, we call it the Nissan Armada, is a Nissan version of the QX80. But this thing's a lot plusser, a lot more, uh, a lot more bling than the Patrol or the Armada. You have this beautiful wooden leather wrapped steering wheel that's also heated. This one has 70,310 miles at the time I'm making this video. We have adaptive cruise control. We have a blind spot warning, blind spot intervention, distance control assist, uh, lane departure warning, uh, lane departure prevention. We have a hydraulic body motion system that will smooth out the ride on beat up uneven pavement and will smooth things out. And it'll also limit body roll for excellent handling. Um, the QX80 is built on rugged body and frame truck based architecture. Uh, great for towing, going, great for going off road. We have a traditional uh, two speed transfer case so you have low, uh, low range four wheel drive. Then uh, for auto mode, that's for all, every, you know, everyday driving. I'll keep it rear wheel drive and send power to the front wheels as needed. And you can also lock it in four wheel drive high. 7-speed automatic transmission, we have heated and air-conditioned front seats, heated steering wheel, beautiful upgraded wood interior trim, navigation, uh, rear parking camera as well as a 360-degree monitor and uh, moving object detection, universal garage door opener, uh, power adjustable steering wheel. We also have an upgraded Bose sound system. There's two Bose sound systems available. The QX80, this has a top-line Bose sound system. Beautiful color combination in graphite gray on graphite leather. We also have the upgraded 22 inch wheel package. A little bit more of a visual impact with those bigger wheels. We also have a rear entertainment system of wireless headphones, uh, heated uh, second row seats, rear climate control. This one has the uh, split bench seat. Normally uh, there's a console here, it's in the back. I think the reason why people uh, took the console out for a number of reasons. If you have kids, sometimes it's easier just to get in and out of the seat, sometimes without having to fold it forward, having that little passway there. But also, if you're carrying stuff quite often in the vehicle, uh, removing that center console allows for a little bit more flusher, flatter uh, cargo surfaces with the seats folded down. But if you do prefer to have that center console, uh, we can install it for you, or you can install it on your own, uh, on your own accord when you're ready to. Uh, when properly equipping until 8,500 pounds with the QX80. Here's the uh, center console right here. Easily installable, uh, power reclining and adjustable. Uh, third row seats, power rear lift gate. One beautiful full size luxury SUV. I've been with Infinity since 2004, and the QX80 is one of my favorite products. I do uh, have it on my list of uh, Infinities I want. So maybe one day when we're ready to upgrade our Infiniti FX37 into something larger, probably our next vehicle will very well be a QX80 like this. For an engine, we have a 5.6 V8 pumping out 400 horsepower. One awesome full-size SUV. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video. Hope to see you soon and have a wonderful day.